This time of year, it looks like a unique Christmas decoration at this intersection near New Milford. But all year round, it's a display standing to declare this is Milk Can Corners. The milk cans were from each of the farmers. Julie Gray's grandfather put this up decades ago. They used to have a lot of people that would get lost on this corner. So, <laughs> so that's why they started putting in Montrose and Halstead. When we came to see it, a crowd of neighbors gathered to show it off, to share the history. Is that how the milk would have been transported the back then? Was, was in these cans? Yeah. That's, that's <laughs> Probably. When, I, when I was a kid, this was the way milk was shipped. It's called Milk Can Corners because the horse and buggy drawn carts couldn't make it up Franklin Hill. All the farmers had to bring their cans of milk down here for it to go to market. Trying to get a milk truck to, with cans to go up that hill, the cans are going to slide back and fall out the back of the truck or bounce around. That's the story behind the Milk Can Corners name. But from this crew, we quickly learned this display is a monument to much more. I mean, That's it was, all it was, it was all dairy farms. There was nothing but dairy farms. The names on the cans represent the families that had dairy cows here. Now, how many of the families that are on here are still in dairy farming? Is, is it? That's none. Yeah. None. none. My dad was the it's all gone. Uh, the land uh, has been mostly abandoned. Everyone here has ties to those dairy days. Well, my dad bought our farm 100 acres for $1,000 in 1940. <laughs> that changed. Expenses put many dairy farmers out of business all over the county. Art Bowles' name is on a can. He was the last dairy farmer here. That was our work, six, seven days a week. And the only day I knew which day a week it was, we went to church. <laughs> Hard work. For the whole family. I used to ride the tractor because I didn't want to be under the cow. <laughs> now, fond memories. Oh, Mary. Yep. I was a good life, I thought. But Jim and Art, you also remember when all the farmers got together and helped each other. Oh yeah, that's that one was, thing. And they, of course, <clears throat> they loved having dinner at my mother's too, but anyway. Uh, <laughs> We came to see a unique sign at a place with an interesting name. This is our, our history and this is what we have left. We save it. We found what's really a memorial to dairy farming and the families who were dedicated to their community and each other. John Meyer, Newswatch 16 on the Pennsylvania Road in Susquehanna County.